everybody. Um, I hope you guys are having a good Saturday morning. I thought that maybe I would do a little video. Um, I need to update my favorites to you guys because it's changed since then. Plus, I have gotten a few products in between then, like between the summer must-have and uh, my last showing of stuff. So I didn't really say, like, what's my favorite. Um, today I've been playing around with a new book. So I've been using my handy dandy super flip kit, which I believe they're still available on my site. So if you place an order, you could be able to get one for it. If not, if they do have it and you guys place an order, you never know. This could be your freebie gift. But I use the colors um, Fairy Dust and Edge because I wanted to try something. I wanted to try something, and it came out pretty good. I I think I play, I think I give myself credit for that one. This it just, it came out really good. So I would say this would be my definitely my going out look, especially with the eyeshadow part. Now lipstick I've used um. I used a little bit of my ginger stamp. I used my little bit of my gloss gorgeous and also used um, some of my um, made lip glosses which I love these and we're gonna since we're doing the favorites thing from starting with them I this is gonna be my number one favorite a new one um, just I've used these are been like I said before that these were made um, from um, my soon to be gone lip glosses and samples that I had uh, from Avon too and I decided to do this and it came out pretty good so these are I definitely recommend them if you know how to make your own if not let me know and I'll, I'll send you the link to the video of how I learned how to do them they're pretty it's pretty easy pretty simple definitely Definitely, I would suggest if if you want to find some color, some like some colors that you wouldn't see yourself wearing, and then melt it, mixing them up with another color, and probably come out a really cute color. And then there you go, you just bought two, and you just created a third color. So there you go. It's like getting two for the price of one. I mean, well, one buy two get one free or something like that, or just buy one get your thing. And I definitely love this. Hmm. Though I have the lip glosses on the other side, I just more tend to try to do that and I just gave myself an idea I might end up making some more lip glosses today so yeah um yeah definitely for the lip I definitely will tell you my juice gem because these are my fun 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 thing that I like to have when I forget due to the time I do have a tendency of forgetting to put on like at least some lip gloss and if I don't put on like the makeup part I do forget to put on the lip gloss and so I mean yeah so it, I always keep this in my purse and so when I be like halfway out I'll be like oh sh I forgot and then I can just go ahead and just be like digging my purse and be like oh my juice gem it's my lifesaver trust me I've done it many a times uh, for my eyeshadows, definitely, like I said, from the Super Flip Kit, and I definitely suggest, I'm going to do these two at the same time. I suggest, um, definitely getting yourself a palette. Well, my mark palettes are going to be changing soon, and they're going to be really, really cute. I cannot wait to reamp mine. This is the Mega Palette, which can do four eyeshadows, well, it can do eight eyeshadows, two, four blushes, or as you see here, the combination of four blush, two blushes, and four eyeshadows, which actually all of them I can honestly say are one. The fairy dust, um, this is the biscotti, yeah, and you got the Piccadilly, and then you got the um, corset, or was it no plum velvet? Plum velvet is my favorite. That's one I have used before, and that's this one. These two, sorry, look. These two I have used so much before, and I actually used these two, made it into like a look like this, and it came out pretty great. But I also used Piccadilly instead too, which is another purple that we have. 
But I don't think the plum velvet is still there, so. Oh, my hair. So, yeah. Um, I don't do too much blush, but I do love it. So, I, I have my moments where I decide to just put on blush. So, I do keep, I do keep it just in case. Um, I just have a lot. Like, eyeliners. Um, I have two that I use, which is, one is the on the line eyeliner. I don't use it, this is what I used before. This is my first eyeliner that I tried from Mark, and I've been using it since then. But it's a liquid eyeliner, but and I don't use it too much now because my hands is, I have that moment of really being shaky, so it doesn't come, it, it makes it look weird when it comes out, so I don't use it too much, so I do use my No Place to Run eyeliner, which is good. But I like this because it comes on the hookup, and it's great. Oh, I'm sorry, I forgot one item for the lip. The lip, don't forget, my lip click here, my new I keep in my purse kind of thing, and the ginger snap, it's a good color. I, I have mixed it in between my other colors that I have on today, but I love it. And I love the little magnetic top on it because... I could throw this thing in the purse and it doesn't come off. So unless you demagnetize it, but I don't I don't I haven't seen anybody saying anything about it being demagnetized. So yeah. Um my mascaras. I'm a little unorganized today. That's what I get from mixing stuff. Oh, don't forget my gloss gorgeous for the looking. I like I said, I can't go without that one. Um I since I can't find my mascara I just had that thing here okay I got one which is the one that I used when I first started using mark which is my oh, there it is, which is my uh, scandalash I love this stuff this is pretty awesome and it's good because this here can go with my um, on the on the line eyeliner and connect and it's actually really good for me for when I'm on the go and I'm in the middle between um, going to one place to another and I have to do a touch up so yay it can just take it off like here do what I got to do close it back do this and then there go my eyeliner and then do what I gotta do and close it back and there you go I love these. These are our Mark hookups, and what I Mark hookups, they're good for the on-the-go thing. And you can buy these two and get the connector free, or if you just wanna, if you already have like like if you have bought some and you need some extra connectors, they're just fifty cent. So, but I like to I like to buy two and get the connector for free because it's great. So pretty much it's like twelve dollars getting three products. Yeah, I love it. So yeah, and my other one is my Make It Big Mascara so Lash Plumping, which actually does help me. I, most people say it clumps, but it doesn't really clump because I make sure I'm 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 usually pretty careful with doing my mascara. It's probably why I don't really have too much problems, but I love this thing and it's so huge, but it's great. This is also my purse keeper. So yeah, I I I do that. Okay. For skin care, for body skin care stuff like that, um, I haven't used this one item, but I'm definitely definitely recommending it because I'm going to be using it soon, which is the Got to Go Gradual Glow um, Body Moisturizing Lotion, and it's a, it's our um, ow, our new uh, Mark Tanner, which is everybody's been making good compliments in it. It has SPF 15, so definitely good for when you go out. And and you know in the sun and it's great it's okay I just need you to know that you're not going to see results like instantly but if you do it the way the directions say this is a daily use you can tan it to how long you want it to tan and well you should start seeing you should see it right then and there I mean I don't know but for for they say for best results is use it daily you know a little bit daily on the body make sure you um when you do use it to uh, rub it in so it's dry because you don't because it's not going to work right it doesn't streak 
as far as I know, it doesn't streak, but it smells great. So, I definitely recommend this. Um, another product that I recommend, which is apparently wants to hide from me today. I don't know why, because I used it earlier. A little sad about that part. Um, okay, until I can find it, let me go to the other stuff. Is it in my purse again? Because... Yeah, but anyway, um, oh, there it is. My Get It Tint. It's us, that's the, it's another moisturizer. I'm sorry, I'm probably having a bad day or something. It's another moisturizer, SPF. It's, this is my, um, I, my, definitely have to be in my purse because I said so. So, yeah, um, it's a great Get It Tint moisturizer, um, I love it. I didn't, at uh, first I was skeptical of using it, but I definitely like to kind of use it now. Um, the new thing I like to introduce that I use, as you can tell, probably tell, is like right down to here now, which is my the Lemon Sugar 3-in-1 um, Shower Shampoo and Body Wash. I've used it as a shampoo and it made my hair feel so soft. I also used it as a, I use it as bubble baths more now, which is really relaxing to do a lemon sugar bath after um, treating your skin, to, treating your face to a little spa thing, and it's so great. Because I still, like I said, I still use my cleanser, which I recommend, but I say like it depends on your body type, your skin type combination. If you got oily, dirt, and stuff like that, and I suggest you go check that out on the Mark site or contact me and we can work something meet up and work something out um my matte chance lotion definitely recommending if you got acne blemish finishers i'm kind of sad because today's the last day for this i'm sorry but yeah and my all-time love is my shine fighter facial mask this mask i use one i'm definitely no i'm not going anywhere later on and oil control because I really have problems with the skin which makes it hard which without using this stuff will make it harder hard for me to actually use um makeup so I sh for me to have my makeup to actually look like yeah look great so that's what I mean um another thing I like to use is the after sun body balm and definitely recommend this one here if you have like if you're prone to getting sunburns because this actually helps it don't you don't um some I know that some people said that they used it when they had a sunburn and then the next day they started seeing like results like they were red and really red and then they started seeing that the red redness has subsided some was starting to subside so they definitely recommend it and I recommend it because sometimes too that I get you know been in the sun too long and it helps me I use it all the time so if I know I'm going to be in the sun sometimes I'll put it on a little before so it can help to pr help it and then also when I'm come home when I come home relax I definitely definitely use this stuff so the after sun after sun body balm is definitely recommendable definitely for sunburn and um it's because it has aloe in it, and you know, aloe is is good for sunburns, and actually, it's good for burns and irritations and stuff. So, yeah, definitely, definitely use that. Um, foundations. I should have two sets of foundations. I tell me to recommend. This is my first love, which is the Natural Powder Buff. But this is not mine. This is actually my my demo product, which is this. I use mine in almond, and I loved it so much. So this is probably like my fall one. I'll mix it in there. Damn, Twitter. Um. Yeah, I love. It's my my first love, and yeah, I'll never forget it. Like I said, but that's not what I currently use. My current usage is the Mark Mineral. And I know most people say you actually spend that amount of money for it. Yeah, but for eighteen dollars, I did. I I've been using this for a couple of months, and I still haven't even hit pan yet. I'll hit pan. I'll hit. I'm, I'm more likely to hit pan using the 
natural powder buff than I would the what's the name within the um mineral. And look, I'm you can tell that it's been used, but I still haven't hit pan. I haven't hit pan. I hit pan on some eyeshadows before. I hit pan on the biscotti. I hit pan on the dragonfly. Uh, yeah, green was definitely the king thing and like that. But yeah, um, I haven't. Oh, I did hit some pan on blushes before. So yeah, I hit pan on a lot of them, but I haven't hit pan recently, which is shocking. Um, yeah, so my next one will be the Glowdacious because it's my fun little bronzer here. And, um, I love the little brush that it comes in. I could just sweep it here, brush it here. I usually use it in the, in the vicinities of here and here and maybe a little bit up there. And then, uh, like I got, put it there, 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 and then rub it in a little bit. So it's kind of like a little glow all over and it's wonderful wonderful stuff I haven't used it today because I was just actually just putting the makeup on just to do this video and plus I was experimenting and stuff like that I've been up early for some reason weird on the Saturday so yeah I love to use it perfumes are my two things that I have currently loved to use of course you guys know I love to use my Ibiza which I'm sad to say I'm pretty much about halfway through this but it's a great light scent and if you like honeysuckle in it definitely recommend her but for some people it's a hit and miss but for the summer it's not a strong scent and it lasts long and I really suggest using it with the after sun body balm because if you really smell this and and this it's pretty much a set to me so I usually try to if I can I'll usually get these as hostess gifts as sets but it's to my really more de my more determined hostess is usually like pick that out I usually let them create a wish list and then do that so um I got a party coming up next month so I'm trying to look for some this month but we'll see how it goes yeah my other one new love is my Mark Sanctuary. Now, the Mark Sanctuaries, I have to tell you today, the Mark Sanctuaries, definitely, definitely a keeper. This is what I keep in my purse. Now, this I keep here at the house. I don't know why. I just, well, it's kind of weird. To me, this is like kind of weird carrying this bottle of perfume right there to me. So, I like something small and easy to go. And this, and I keep this. This is actually the Peony Apple. It's from the Peony Apple set. It's really good. I love it. It's a really light scent. You can smell the fresh apples. It's like fresh apples almost in the rain, but in a good way. It's a really good, light, refreshing, refreshing scent, and I definitely recommend it. And right now, it's actually just, I'm really sad about it. I don't know if it's going to still stay there. I think it's it may be there for a while. But this, all this one, and then there's very cranberry, which highly recommendable it's all in the last chance section so you're gonna get it for even less for even less price that it actually is so I would suggest you go today check it out place an order for it if you if you want to share it try it out you can't be mad at yourself even if you don't like it because you're not paying for a price for it you're paying you're getting either 50 to 60 percent off on the mark this mark item because it's in the last chance and also check out the other last chance thing I'm so mad that I missed the heels but that's okay. They'll I they I think they'll be back again. They've been back off and on, so I'm not gonna be mad about it. They ch they change the thing every two weeks, so I won't know until around the time the new mag comes out. So yeah, um, definitely recommend this. Get it the thing. See me, I got this in a pop up sale, so I got it even let about around the same price as it was in the, as, that it is in the last chance. So it's a good deal. So I didn't really pay full price either. <laughs> But anyway, I definitely recommend this, and I definitely recommend if you're gonna get this to get the body butter also, and then the see the body butter is the body butter and yeah and the shower wash because all of them combined the set is leaving you even longer lasting scent. Though this does, and I tested it out, this does last the whole day, 
getting the other sets to it actually lasts a little bit longer too and definitely highly recommendable um yeah i i love it um i don't think i have any other products that i wanted to introduce but yeah these are my like my favorite usage products that i've used right now so yeah it's oh yeah definitely for accessories well not really accessories but for like sorry i have to put these on now definitely for like um to really to really get good and help protect yourself from the sun i definitely suggest you getting the fedora i know i didn't wear it today i just i'm not really feeling the fedora wearing today today i wore earlier going to the store well yeah so definitely recommend you getting the fedora hat for the summer plus it's cute and with the interchangeable bands that it has it's definitely definitely a keeper do also for me sometimes i'll forget my um brushes which for some reason they're hiding from me again what is everything hiding from me today so anyway um definitely definitely recommend like the brush my this is my eyeshadow brush and i can't find my powder brush but i do have my mini brushes which i haven't touched too much so yeah these are my mini brushes from the brick kit for sixteen dollars they're totally worth it and then um you can't go out getting the beach bag this is my um definitely a keeper bag here it keeps all my crap in my mark mag logs my mark envelope my mark folders of my stuff for when i go to do an event or just like half or people ask me information about mark so yeah it's definitely my must have items and definitely like a keeper to to use so and i definitely have other products here that i use too but i can't find my favorite nail polish well besides mark but i do have a non-mark nail polish just purple it got glittery thingies on it and oh there it is and it's this it came from walgreens and um i I've been using it so much, the name came off of it. It's I think it's the, the, from the Wet n Wild collection. And that's usually what I usually get. And it was on sale at that time. And I believe they still got it on sale. But I love it because it's so glittery. And I'm usually not a glittery person. But yeah, I kind of like it. But since this video is long than I thought of, that I was going to do, I'm going to end this here and finish doing what I got to do. Because my eyes hurt and I got to take this all this stuff off and do my... Well, I can still do it without it. But... Um, I can't, but my eyes bother me, so I have to wear my glasses. So you guys have a good one. Have a good Saturday. Enjoy the weather. Don't forget to stop by the Mark's shop if you if it's too hot, like it's here, to go shopping outside. Go shopping on on um on my site. Um, when you do place an order, you're gonna be getting a nice little surprise email from me with some extra incentives because you placed an order. I can't tell you because it's gonna be something awesome though. But check it out. Let me know what you think. You guys have a good one. I love you guys. Thanks for subscribing. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. You guys have a good one.